how that works. Sorry. Hi. Um, I'm from Southwark, where you guys are in SE1, yeah? And uh, I'm helping some black parents to do some research about helping their children to do better at school. And one thing they found out is that um, the black parents didn't really get a full understanding of what the requirements or the national curriculum was about in the first place to be able to help the child. Was that your experience as well? Yeah, I, I feel that. Um, I don't think my dad, so sometimes, I don't know if my dad had a lot of pride because I don't think my dad anymore, he knew that. But it's like work that he didn't understand, he was like, like, I don't know if he was standing. Obviously now, now, <laughs> now I can understand that he didn't understand what it was, but he was trying to, yeah, was trying, to like, trying to do his best and be a dad still because that's that was my role model when I was a little kid. So I feel he didn't he didn't understand the work. So he I don't know. Like when I gave him the work, he used to say, Yeah, well done, well done, but I can see in his eyes that he doesn't understand what we're talking about. But I don't feel because they come from education in Africa, and I feel the educational system there is different, and teachers do beat children if they are out of hand, and so you know, things like that, it's just like, I don't feel the curriculum, they really understand it enough, because it's just... It's so better if you know what the targets are, so, you have yeah. to achieve, and there are books in the shops for that, but again, parents don't know that sometimes. And can't afford it. That's true. Can you... Your question, can you just introduce yourself and that's okay. Um, um, and uh, it's mainly to the, the first young person I spoke. You said it's more about culture and less about race. No, say. So, if I misunderstood what you said. So I just wanted to ask, if you think it's more about culture and less about race, how do you define the both? Because I see them as similar. I still think. The race issue and the culture issue are different, but what I, the point I was trying to make is no one is more important than the other. In the sense of. Yeah, in the sense of it's less about yeah. racism yes. and more about culture, culture. but they're yeah. still important. They're both yeah, still, in court. Yeah. still important. I hope that answered your question. Let's talk after. So just going to move it on. Last question. This? Yeah, Just a line, it's going to make a point. I'm really proud to see you young guys standing up and talking like this. Because I was a young person myself. In a serious note, what I went through as a young person, um, I can understand where you guys are coming from. And I think you've took the badness and turned it into something positive and something good. Because that's what I always learned um, from my children. Because I was this kind of educated person, and I'm glad that you that you know that you said about your dad trying to help, but he didn't really understand. But I was fortunate to have a, um, a, 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 a supplementary school right next to me um, called the Kai. And uh, my children went there from very young. Uh, my daughter came out, you know, with a two one. Um, I would do it married. You know, so all these things, it's about the parenting and the encouragement that I think the parents have given. So even though you guys may feel that you haven't succeeded, um, and even though, you know, you've, you've gone through your tribulations and so forth, but you, you've come out and you're coming out, and I'm looking for you guys to be the leaders of tomorrow. And well done. <laughs>